Hello, fellow Australians. How's it going, bloody mates? Was that good? Did you think you could do better? Don't give me that fucking attitude. Mwah. Let's hop into this shit, shall we? Are you a magician? Wow, that was some really nice B-roll. I'm glad they showed all that. I really, that really dragged me right in. Makes me feel like I'm actually at the restaurant being cringed out. Cool. So, there's that chunk of butter. Now you wish you didn't order it, didn't you? Great, great. More of the girl trying to get a secretary job. Fantastic. Should have gone with the direction yep, of the fearless leader. <laughs> so, we're not sharing, are we? Because you don't share. Never fucking mind? Are we just gonna, what's going on here? Okay? Why are you doing this to me, Doug? I'm all about the sharing. You know what? I'm gonna roll with your suggestion. Mm. And I shall give the fish a try as soon as I uh, down this duck. We're just going through everybody and having them say one sentence? Is that what we're doing right now? That's not annoying. <laughs> I hate, I hate that. Why are you looking at each other while you chew? I would never want to do that. As our first dates continue, another single arrives. Okay, so we're going to a new couple. I guess that's what the title's gonna be then. All right. Good evening. Hello, how are you? I'm well, how are you? Very well, thank you. Virgin, 100%, no doubt in my mind. Is this man 14 or 28? Welcome, my name's Tom, I'm here for dinner. Yeah, oh, Virgin, yeah. My name's Tom. I'm here for dinner. Well, yeah, I don't give a fuck about your name, and obviously you're here for dinner. It's nighttime, and we're a restaurant. Fresh off the plane from Broken Hill is young Tom. Let's head over to the bar. He's new to the city and new to dating. I'm very green in the dating game. I've not been on many dates, and certainly not at a, at a restaurant for dinner either. Why does he look so young? He's older than me. Is that how Australians work? You just, you stay young till about 30 and then instantly look like you're 75? Is that the way it works? I don't know any Australians personally. So that's just a guesstimation. You know, kind of like how Asian people look like they're either, they age really well or like shit. And white people just look like garbage all the time. This will be the first time I've done it. You look very smart, sir. Oh, thank you very much. It's my pleasure. <laughs> Blushing. <laughs> Did you say you look very smart? Is that a thing? You're never going to hear that in America, especially because everybody looks fucking stupid. And by the way, he also looks stupid. He looks like he's going to his first job fair. Like he had all these leftover clothes that he didn't want to wear, but his mom's like, you need to dress up nice for this because how else are they going to hire you to be the accountant over at the local lawn mowing place? Landscaping, that's what it's called. At the local landscaping thing, even though Australia doesn't have grass. It just has spiders and sand. I've never, by the way, ever seen a picture of Australia. Let, let me just go really quickly to show you what I know about Australia. You say mate, you say bloody, you got kangaroos, no dogs or cats, and you have huge spiders. What's that for? And the big part is this little, the little piggy right here. The spiders part. That's why I'm never gonna go to Australia, I'm sorry. Well, sir, don't you worry, we're all friends here. <laughs> Good on ya. I've not yet had a girlfriend, actually. We know. I could have told you that. But. That's part of the whole, the whole thing about tonight, is finding out who's the right girl for me. And that's something which is just so exciting. You're gonna figure that out tonight? By meeting one woman, you're gonna be like, I know which girl now on earth is right for me? You're gonna be very disappointed. Is that your first beer too, buddy? Hmm? Should you bring your mom? Is she here? Also stepping out of her comfort zone is small town girl Vanessa. Well, I've been born and raised in Bright. Bright's a really little country town. That dress just looks like you got back from prom. I was gonna say take it off, but then you'd be naked, and I don't think that's legal, so like don't. And as a 19 year old, there's not a lot to do. The guys from Bright, they're all just looking for a bit of fun, really. You know, they don't like commitment, so I'm kind of looking to expand my horizons. <laughs> 19! 19 years old? Is that what we're doing here? What's the legal drinking age in Australia? Is she gonna order a milk? Maybe a chocolate milk if she's feeling dangerous? Rim it with some cocoa at the top? 
And by the way, she does not look 19, she looks about 14. Just throwing that out there. Hello, Hi. how are you? I'm good, thank you, how are you? Very well, looking very glamorous. Thank you. There's a lovely young gentleman just sitting at the bar, just waiting for you. Just make your way over there. <laughs> oh, oh, that's, that's a thumbnail right there, baby, yeah. That's how you get a date. That's why you're still a virgin, buddy. Okay. He literally, he really, he really, and did, he did a double take. Yeah. My thumb is in my dog's mouth right now. This dog, this one. If you guys didn't know, I had a dog. He's right, this one. Look how annoyed he is. It's just my love and affection. Thank you. What, what was that? What, what's going on here with the mouth, huh? What'd you say? You just cast a spell on this girl? I'm calling the police! I do believe in love. <laughs> love is, you know, it's everywhere. <laughs> it's beautiful. You know, it's, I don't know what to say about it. I do believe in it, though. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea what she was talking about. I was not listening at all. So if someone wants to fill me in, I'm sure it was stupid and worthless though. Probably had to do with like, ah, uh, you know, I don't like algebra. You know, I'm in school, I had to get out of school early for this. Uh, I'm, I'm really having a tough time. I'm, I'm going to a tutor tomorrow. That's a joke because she's so young, right? Get it, like she still does home, all right. Hi, how you going? Hi. I'm, I'm, I'm Vanessa. I'm Tom, nice, nice to meet you, Vanessa. Nice to meet so you. So good to see you. <laughs> nice to see you. Wanna take a seat? Yeah, sure, thanks. <laughs> no worries, good to see you. Good to see you. Wait, 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 wait. Let, let me just, I need a sip of her. What the? <coughs> I strike way too. Uh, what was going on there? What the hell was that? Okay, that they both the the awkwardness and the nervousness just irradiated. They threw up nervousness into each other's mouths. Wasn't it like a? Well, I could have sworn you're like a Family Guy where where they one starts throwing up and the other one's throwing up because the other one's throwing up. Then they all start throwing up. They're throwing up more because that person's throwing up. That happened, right? That's what kind of happened with the nervousness here. He's like, "Nice to see you." She's like, "Oh, it's nice to see you too." Why'd you take a seat? It's nice to see you. She's like, "It's nice to see you too." That's 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 what kept that's all he said. That's it. And now his face is as red as mine. Gee, how amazing experience. <laughs> Pretty, pretty weird. How are you feeling? <laughs> I'm alright. You're fine, hey? Yeah. No, no, terrific to see you. Look, nice you look absolutely you. lovely. Thank you. I love the way you're doing your hair as well. <laughs> he said it again. He said it again. It's nice to see you. And she, she responded. She's like, it's nice to see you too. Like, we know. We've all been there. Like, we all heard it twice. It's the rule of threes, right? Yeah, okay. It's no, beautiful. It's just <laughs> Oh, thank you. Oh. It's just all natural. A bit speechless, perhaps. <laughs> a little bit. I'm still, you know, trying to get into the mood. <laughs> of course, yeah, yeah. I may not have had a girlfriend before, but I feel I am of the old-fashioned variety. Says every virgin on Earth. Every single man who has not shoved his penis inside an orifice of a female has said, I'm just old-fashioned. I'm not like every other guy. Chivalry? Yeah, that's my fucking middle name. Even though that would be fucking retarded. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm the kind of guy who wants to open doors, who wants to pay the bill, all that kind of stuff. Maybe I'm just a dreamer, maybe uh, it's, it, it's different in the real world, but, <laughs> but hey, you just gotta have a go, and, um, and that's me, so. Yeah, buddy, it is different in the real world. That's why you're a virgin. Like I've reiterated several times, just like how you said it's nice to see her, I'm gonna keep saying you're a virgin. I'm gonna be me. <laughs> Thank you. Pleasure. <laughs> Let's see. Just so nice to meet you. <laughs> sweet, sweet mother of God. Jesus, please smite me down. Still, I want to die. I want to die just so fucking bad right now. There's no coming back from this, buddy. Okay, she's, you know what she's going to do? She's like, oh, I, I got to be nice. I got to go on this date. It's got to go well. It's on TV. But after this, her and her friends are going to talk shit about you for the rest of their lives. Every, your group chat, the group chat photo is of this. That's what their group chat photo is. And then the, the name of the group chat is whatever your name is, and then is a cuck. Oh, shut Thank up. you. <laughs> Thank you. I've been to a couple of restaurants, but nothing like this. Yeah. You've been to a couple of restaurants in 19 years. A couple is two. You sure? You wanna do a quick recount? 
Because now, to me, that's a fact. You said it on television. That could be used against you in the court of law. Very beautiful. Yes. Little rose as well. Nice touch. Nice touch. You're very observant. Do you want to have sex with me? Very nice touch. <laughs> very beautiful. <laughs> Thank God that cringe fest is over. That looks like two 13 year olds who just hit the age to get away from the kid table. You know what I'm saying? I got a family party where there's a kid table, but now they get to sit at an adult table, but the adult table's just for them. It looks like we have Caveman next, and um, what's that one Mortal Kombat character who has the teeth with the big mouth? She wears a thing around her face and she has the teeth? That's what that bitch's name is now. I don't know. To me, that was the worst shit I've seen in my entire life. I'm pretty sure. If he rewatches this, it will make him infertile. I get that it's his first date, and 100% and his last, at least with her. But it was so awkward, and it was just so young. And he's older than me. He seemed like the nerdy kid who walks up to the popular girl. You know, like in every movie, the nerdy kid walks up to the popular girl and asks her out to the dance. That's what it seemed like this entire time. And it's gonna get worse. Because now he's drinking, and he's gonna say something stupid. Like, nice to see ya. After he's been sitting with her for an hour. Fuck, I hate that guy. I hate him. I'm sure she's just so fantastic. Great hair. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Great meeting you. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to kill myself. i smack that face right up there to subscribe if you haven't already. Boop. Two videos right over there. And if you want to help support the channel and want to help it grow, go to uh, patreon.com slash wineboxpoppy. You know, right there, yeah. It's really nice, really nice to see you. It's nice. Mwah.